Hey YouTubers and welcome back to Tony the Technician channel and today we're going into the Amazon tool deals and we're going to be looking at th something special. We've gone over multiple different types of tools, done dedicated Amazon videos on specific tools and then sometimes I just do a mix of any good deal that I can find. So these are either going to be tools that are on sale, tools that even at their full list price I believe to be good deals and tools I find interesting and would like your guys' opinion on. Today we're actually going to be looking at some of the best bit socket sets that I can find on Amazon, that being both the standard chrome with S2 steel and impact rated ones as well. Uh, I tried to find a couple of each and then there's actually a couple that I believe are the same and would like your guys' opinion on. If you guys know more into them, I tried to do as much research as possible and found actually more similarities and not so much any differences so to my belief these could be the very same sets just for a big price difference uh, but we'll get into those we'll get into those in just one second first up on the list is actually going to be a brand that I don't use a whole lot I've had some bad experiences with like a plier set that I had from them and and something else uh, many years ago so I, I kind of started to stay away from Nyko in the last six or so years but these I've had probably for five years and haven't had an issue with now obviously this comes with some very small impact rated bit you get three thirty seconds eighth inch five thirty seconds three sixteenths seven thirty seconds and quarter inch when it comes to those quarter inch drive ones I'm not doing a whole lot of hard impacting on them uh, but surprisingly enough all of the three eighths and the half inch drive I haven't really used the half inch drives too much, but the, the 3 8 ones here in the center, 9 30 seconds through 9 16 have held up very well. I haven't broken any of them, and obviously I'm a little bit more cautious when I'm using the quarter inch ones because even though they're impact rated, they are still very small bits. Uh, so that's something to consider. You can't expect to buy a set like this, no matter what the brand, and slap this on a impact and have it set to a thousand foot pounds and expect that thing to uh, not destroy it <laughs> so you have to kind of use common sense when it comes to these and for the last six years I've used them quite a bit and uh, they've held up very well so this is a Nyko product that I've really enjoyed this is Chromoly you guys can find the other sets as well they have different lengths and everything so a good variety from Nyko. So three thirty seconds through three quarters, and uh, it comes in all three drive sizes. I'm really happy with it, especially for twenty four dollars down from thirty dollars. It has four and a half stars at two thousand nine hundred and fifty three ratings. So next up is actually a brand that I've never used, but this is one of the brands that we're going to be discussing today. If you guys have used them, I would really like your opinion on. So this is originally has a list price of $40 down to $30. This is the Mix Power 3H Drive Low Profile Impact Bit Socket Set. This is all Allens. You get a good variety of both metric and SAE. Uh, it does skip some sizes, like with the metric you get 6, 7, 8 skips nine you get 10 12 14 17 and 19 and you got three quarters basically the same thing as you know your 19 you got five eighths nine sixteenths half inch seven sixteenths three eighths five sixteenths down to a quarter so these are also chromoly the solid one piece construction it eliminates weak points it has a black phosphate finish and i think for thirty dollars this is a really good set especially when you see other sets out there such as this Sunex set, which also has solid one-piece construction, eliminates weak points. So it also includes the exact same sizes, 6, 7, 8, skips 9, you have 10, 12, 14, 17, 19. Now, when it comes to Sunex impact sockets, it is no question they are some of the best impact sockets on the market for the price. Uh, they're definitely up there with a lot of others. Uh, they're very competitive. You can really beat up on some Sunex sockets and they hold up very well. I don't have very much experience with their hand tools like ratchets and chrome sockets and things like that but when it comes to their impact sockets I know they're very durable uh, and some of the best priced stuff out there. For a long time Sunex had really no competition in its price range. Um, Gray Pneumatic is also good but not great to buy through Amazon uh, and now gray pneumatics prices seem to be well of well above that of Sunex in most cases 
Um, so SunX just does a really good job. Well, in the last couple years maybe, uh, where you, you're starting to find more and more of these brands that you've never heard of, I really enjoy SunX products and their pricing and everything. Um, but now, to me, correct me if I'm wrong, but I try to do as much research as I can on some of these other brands and then flipping back and forth from this set and another set I'll show you here in a, a few minutes, I can't really find anything that shows me that these aren't identical sets. The only thing different between this set and the one we just looked at was the blow molded case that it came in. The Sun X one actually has a black tab here um, where the other one is just kind of molded into the case. It's, it's a cheaper case. But as far as the sockets, they're both chromoly, both Taiwan, exact same sizes, same finish. I can't find anything as far as these two sets to be different from one another. So I do believe that that set and the Sun X set are the same. This one is $39 or $40 down from $50, where this one is $30 down from $40. So it's $10 cheaper. Now, can I say 100% certainty that they're the same? No, but from everything that I can tell, I think they're the same set. Now, when it comes to sets underneath like $50, it doesn't really bother me to just go ahead and pick up the Sun X ones. But when you get into the more expensive sets, if I can save a decent amount of money, there's a possibility I might go with the cheaper one. Big factor being warranty, depending on the brands that I'm choosing from. Sun X may have a much better warranty than something like this Mix Power or Castleman or these other brands that you may not have heard of. Uh, you kind of take that risk of not getting a warranty or having a warranty. You might wait a month for a tool and have to jump through hoops. I don't know. There's always a risk like that. But as far as I can tell, these, these two sets are the same, um, and these are just two for an example. But I think for $30, this is a great set, and then the Sun X one is $40. Next up is a Molework 64-piece Master Torx Automotive Mechanics tool set. This is going to include quarter-inch, three-eighths, and half-inch drive sockets. They are Torx and then E-Torx, and then you have some adapters and stuff. So normally, I wouldn't throw something like that this in here, but truthfully... Actually, about I think 2017 time frame, I actually got a Molework bit socket set. And while like the chrome portion at the bottom wasn't like the most clean chrome, the sockets, the bit sockets themselves, actually held up really well. So I was very surprised in them. So I figured it's at least worth a mention. Molework does have a handful or a, a decent amount of. Uh, tools on here for really good prices. So I figured I'd at least throw this one in here. It's $63, four and a half stars at 756 ratings. It is chrome vanadium with S2 steel. So the bits themselves are S2 steel. And then the chrome socket is going to be chrome vanadium. And you do get uh, a good variety here as well, which is really nice adapters and reducers and everything included in the set. So I think it's a good set for $63, and it's rated pretty dang highly as well. Now here's another set. Keep this image in your head. This is the Castleman 84-piece 3H Drive Master Hex Bit Impact Socket Set, and it is uh, chromoly, SAE, and metric impact grade. You get shallow and mid-length, I would call it, so a good variety, and it's not just Allen's. It is primarily Allen's, but you also get Torx as well, and actually triple squares. So there's actually a very good variety here. Okay, so here you have your e-Torx, your triple squares, your tamper-proof Torx, and your Torx. So a good variety there. Here's everything else that you get. You, you know, you got your Allens, e-Torx, tamper-proof and non-tamper-proof and your triple squares and they are both stamped and laser engraved so dual size markings and this set is a hundred dollars it has four and a half stars at 63 ratings so just a quick look at it and then here is the mix power which is also going to include the same size of everything e torx triple squares tamper proof non tamper proof allens all of that uh, here's the list once again the chrome ollie Think phosphate, and it is also the same price, $100. This one has three and a half stars at five ratings, so definitely not as well known. 
um, but everything as far as the sockets everything is the exact same and it's set up the exact same inside of the case as well exact same layout exact same sockets included same price 84 pieces just like the other set and then you have the Sun X 35693H drive master hex bit socket set 84 pieces just like the other two sets we just looked at same exact layout I think the blow motor case once again is a little bit nicer than the other two not really a big deal there same exact e torx torx tamper proof torx allens triple squares same exact layout same exact sizes uh, unfortunately surprisingly enough sun x has the least amount of photos with just the one photo but looking at it it is chromoly and i actually it's probably a little bit easier on my phone but i went through and looked it includes the exact same sizes the triple squares are down here as well Allen's. As far as I can tell, this is the same set as the Castleman and the Mix Power. Now, when it came to that smaller set, it was only a $10 difference. I would have probably just went with the Sun X one just to, I'd rather have the Sun X uh, warranty. But this one is $180, so you're paying $80 more. That's a rough one. I don't know if I would pay $80 more from what I can tell, just from the research that I've done quickly on the uh, Amazon and Google, I spent maybe an hour or so looking into all three, comparing them, and I couldn't find any differences except for um, the blow molded case, which even the layout inside is different. It's just really the, the latches. It's not very often I would find sets that are the same as Sun X for a much better price because most of the time I would just go Sun X, no questions asked, just because I have very good experience with Sun X. But when I see something that's almost eighty dollars cheaper, that's a different that's a different story. That would be a a difficult one to consider. So please let me know your guys' experience if you guys have used Mix Power or Casamin, and what are your guys' thoughts? Do you guys think this Sun X is the same as those other two ones? I don't know. I can't say with 100% certainty, but everything that I can see points to the direction of them being the same. Next up, we're looking at a set that I actually own. This is the Gear Wrench 84 piece set. This is uh, not the impact grade. It's just your standard uh, chrome socket with the S2 steel. I have really enjoyed this set. I think I picked this set up for 90 bucks seven years ago. Um, $135, that's kind of pushing it. It's still worth it, I think. I think $135 is probably the most I would pay for this set, but if you guys are interested in this set, either consider some of the other ones that I show in this video, or just wait. This one will float around closer to the $100 price range, so you can always wait for that sale. Uh, this is four and a half stars at 1,436 ratings. You get a bunch of e torques here up front. You get tamper-proof Torx, Torx, Allens, both metric and SAE, and then you get ball Allens, long ball Allens, and long torques. Uh, definitely a good variety, and it is going to be in all three drive sizes, so it's nice. You get a variety of everything. Um, you're not sticking a three quarter inch bit socket onto a quarter inch ratchet or anything like that. So, here's actually a Casamin set. Keep in mind, Carbine Carbine also sells a lot of these sets similar to Gear Wrench, but they are not cheaper than gear wrench i've never used the brand but i did notice their pricing is all higher so it wasn't even worth showing um, but this Casaman, it's a 107 piece set so you're getting even more than the gear wrench from an 84 piece to 107 piece and it's also in all three drive sizes you get torx extra long tamper proof allens ball allens sae and metric they're once again chrome sockets with the s2 steel bits this one has four and a half stars at 59 ratings at $80, $90. I do believe this to be a good set, especially for $90. Let me know your guys' thoughts. Next time, we'll move on to some of the Tecton sets. So this is the Tecton 3H Drive Hex Torx Phillips slotted square bit socket set. They have a wide variety of different sizes. Tecton is going to have a huge lineup of different sets available if you check out their website. You can see all of them. I just threw one that was around $100 price range. And then last up, we're actually looking at a set from Capri Tools. This is the master set from them. This is the 88-piece set. They also have other size sets as well. I just figured I'd throw in one of their bigger sets so you guys can see a variety of what they offer. This one is at $173, down from $200. And this has 4.5 stars at 96 ratings. And this is going to be Torx and Hex. You got your E-Torx up here at the top. Your Stubby Allens here. Stubby Torx. The rest of the Allen's stubbies are going to be here at the bottom. 
So Torx on the right, Allen's on the left, and then some more of the larger e Torx at the bottom. You got some of the long Torx and Allen's up here on the top, and then some more long Allen's and Torx at the bottom as well. I don't necessarily like the layout now, question really. I would probably just throw these all on a rail anyways, so they're not going to be in this case, but it's a nice case. It's a nice complete set. You get a good variety of bit sockets, but I don't like the layout, how everything is just kind of, it's like they just started putting things in and they were like, ah, start this row here. And here is the lineup of sockets that you're going to get if you'd like to pause and take a look. And just some more of their miscellaneous sets that they have available. So they definitely have a huge lineup. I figured I'd just show you one of the bigger ones so you guys can get an idea of what they offer. That's it as far as the bit socket sets. Once again, we got quite a few good brands on here, quite a few good sets. Uh, keep in mind, all of these brands sell larger and smaller sets. I just figured I'd throw in some of the more popular ones. And then also, please drop a comment down below of your guys' thoughts on the Mix Power Castleman and Sun X. Obviously not all of their products are going to be the same, but these are two of the products that I found that I believe to be the same. But please let me know your guys' thoughts down in the comments. Also keep in mind all of these will be linked down in the description underneath the tools and tools continued link. If you guys would like to pull up the Mix Power, Casamin, and Sun X, you can pull all of those up yourself and compare them and let me know your guys' thoughts. But other than that, I really hope you guys enjoyed. If you guys did, please make sure to hit that thumbs up, leave a comment down below, and as always, subscribe if you're not a subscriber. See you guys next time.